Hello, River Landing. For the first eight years of my ministry, while I was doing two seminary degrees, I served as a youth and youth music minister, where I got to experience such spiritual heights as summer camp and lock-in retreats. It was after a middle school lock-in that I came to the realization that there really is a purgatory. It was also during that time that I felt the call to pastoral ministry with adults who don't do lock-ins. But I simply traded one set of challenges for another. Every summer I took my youth group and choir on mission trips. They typically worked with some helping capacity during the day and had concerts in the evening. We sang in churches and parks and shopping malls, wherever we could find a place. And every year there was some concert venue that fell through, which left a hole in our schedule which is very undesirable. With teenagers, you need the time to be filled with something purposeful, anything that keeps those adolescents from creating their own fun. Because I had those experiences early in ministry, whenever touring choirs needed a place to sing, I did my best to host them. I haven't done that since I was a pastor, but deja vu, I got a call from a friend whose colleague was in that situation. After a cancellation, they were looking for a place to sing in North Carolina. So I asked management and activities and everyone was willing to pitch in to host and feed this choir from New York City. So um, they'll be here this Friday, the 19th, for a 7 p.m. concert in the NPR. They are an auditioned choir, which means they are pretty good singers. 17 high school students who perform a variety of musical styles. Some have never been this far south. We don't usually get choirs at River Landing, so I thought this would be a nice treat. I also knew that these young people who are discovering their gifts and capacities would get a very appreciative audience at River Landing. You guys are the best. I am eager to meet them and hear them. If you don't have another obligation on Friday of this week, the 19th, would you help me support this group by your presence? They won't be here to earn some money. They will be here because they love music. Some of the best experiences I have ever had were unplanned. I hope this one will be for them and for us. A great experience. They are the Genesis Corral. I hope to see you there and thank you in advance. Have a blessed week.